through red carpet photo opportunities alone. Costume dramas are particularly adept at using the red carpet to promote fashion ideals depicted on screen. For example, the Victorian gowns worn by Emma Stone and Anne Boleyn in Layer Cake and the other Boleyn girl borrowed from historic influences that shaped contemporary Gothic revivals. Meanwhile, the red carpet gowns in the crown were designed to mimic the tailored suits and figure-hugging silhouettes of the post-war era depicted in the series. Red carpets here serve as visual entertainment, transporting audiences to different times and places. In summary, the red carpet has become a runway where glamour, statement pieces and most of all fashion risk-taking come alive before live global audiences. The most memorable and influential red carpet gowns are those that make bold statements, push creative limits or directly translate fashion ideals from screen to spectacle. Red carpet fashion reflects the way major films and celebrities shape cultural attitudes towards style, beauty and self-expression. Through eye-catching and talked-about gowns, the red carpet helps promote the very glamour and imagination it represents. Overall, red carpet fashion is about storytelling, and the stories told become pop culture moments remembered for generations. Red carpet fashion has been a popular topic in Hollywood for decades, and it has been featured in some of the most iconic films of all time. From classic films like Breakfast at Tiffany's to modern blockbusters like The Devil Wears Prada, red carpet fashion has always been a major part of the movie-going experience. In classic films like Breakfast at Tiffany's, red carpet fashion was often used to show off the sophistication and glamour of the characters. The iconic black dress worn by Audrey Hepburn in the film is still one of the most iconic red carpet looks of all time. Similarly, the classic white dress worn by Marilyn Monroe in The Seven Years has become an iconic image of red carpet fashion. In modern films like The Devil Wears Prada, red carpet fashion is often used to show off the modern and edge side of fashion. The iconic red dress worn by Meryl Streep in the film has become an iconic image of red carpet fashion, and it has been copied by many fashion designers. Similarly, the black dress worn by Anne Hathaway in the film has become an iconic image of modern red carpet fashion. Overall, red carpet fashion has been an important factor in the world of films for decades. From classic films to modern blockbusters, red carpet fashion has always been a major part of the movie-going experience, and it has been featured in some of the most iconic films of all time. Red carpet fashion is an essential element of the entertainment industry. It is a showcase for designers to display their latest designs and for celebrities to make a statement with their style. In this essay, we will explore the history and development of red carpet fashion, with a focus on some of the most iconic fashion moments in film history. One of the earliest examples of red carpet fashion in film history is the 1954 premiere of A Star is Born. The film's leading lady, Judy Garland, wore a stunning red dress designed by Jean Louis. The dress was made of silk chiffon and featured a fitted bodice and flowing skirt. The dress became an instant classic, and its daring color and silhouette set the tone for red carpet fashion for decades to come. In the 1960s and 1970s, red carpet fashion became more daring and unconventional. Actress Jane Fonda made waves in 1972 when she wore a sheer, beaded jumpsuit to the Academy Awards. The jumpsuit, designed by Yves Saint Laurent, was a bold statement in a sea of traditional gowns. In the 1980s, red carpet fashion became more glamorous and over-the-top. 